Hey, what's going on everyone? So in this one, I'm going to show you guys how to import products to your Shopify store from Zendrop. Uh, if you haven't seen the video already on how to install Zendrop to your Shopify store, pretty straightforward. The video will be in the description. So let's dive into importing these products. We'll pick up where we left off last, which was on this page. So essentially here is where you can find products over on Zendrop. You'll see that the newest are listed right here. You can start looking for products. And if you have a specific product in mind, of course, you can search that product. So say we wanted to find something like fidget spinner, right? We go ahead and type it in over here. And now we'll see all of these variations of fidget spinners. You'll see the product cost, and you can add it to your import list, or you can actually look at the product details a little bit further. So here on the details page, you can see more information such as the product cost. You can also see the average shipping time, which is 15 days for this product. And then you can also see any variations available as well. So if we want to import this to our store, we can go ahead and click add to import list. And now it's going to be added to our import list and we can find our import list right here. So now that we're in the import list, we will name the product. Now you don't have to do this and you can do this after you've imported the product. Um, but if you wanted to, you could go ahead and put the product name here. Uh, you can put tags if you wanted to tag the products while you're importing them. Um, same with the product type and the collection. In this case, we could just put um, spinners, product type. We could just say fidget, and then we'll leave the collection. Now we can look at the description, and of course you can edit this after as well. So we'll go ahead and leave this description. And the variants, you can be selective with which variants that you import. So in this case, we'll go ahead and import all of them. And we can also see the price here as well. And so this is where we can also see our profit margin um, on these variations as well. So if we're selling this for $27.69, then you can see we're profiting $18.87. That's after the $4.70 shipping, as well as the $4.12 product cost. Here we can also see the images that we'd be importing as well. And if everything looks good to go, then we can go ahead and import to store. And so this is a notice saying that it'll show up as 50,000 units in your inventory over in your store. And it's a placeholder because they can't track the inventory real time. So it also says here that once you start selling a product, it may take longer than one to three days to ship that product. It also says this is normal and it shouldn't happen as you start selling regularly. So we're going to go ahead and click got it and then confirm. Okay, so now the product has been imported. Now we can find it over here on the imported products. Now we'll click view on Shopify. And so that's it. That's all the steps you need to do to import a product with Zendrop over to your Shopify store. If you guys found this video helpful and want more tutorials and more Shopify and e-commerce content like this video, feel free to drop any questions you have down below in the comments as well. I respond to every single comment and make sure you guys join my discord group. The link is going to be in the description as well. And if you need one-on-one -on -one help with your Shopify store, feel free to DM me on Instagram and I'll see you guys in the next one.